So many new things to be found I know a place where you can go Where there's no end to you yes or no to land. Your buttons are not missing. <laughs> hey, everybody. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. <laughs> My buttons were missing. How's everybody doing? How's everybody? Welcome, welcome. Hello, hello. Uh, oh, there we go. Oh, no, off and then on. That was weird. Okay, what? there we go. It's just the delay. <laughs> That's a <all> lot. <laughs> Mm. Hello, Whiskey Sarcasm over on Twitch. Hello, June Hansen, Practically Creative. Uh, Miss Pat Remenshiner, Tracy Albert, uh, Shelly Sows, uh, Mona Did What, Lynn Vilas, Lori Clark. Mm, and then and I missed, I'm missing the rest. I'm sorry. Craft so. a Simple Life for four months. Craft a Simple Life. Thank you so much. Big hugs to you. Hello, June Hanson. Hello, Michelle the Quilter. Hello, Lerlin, Kent, Marcus, Sophie. Yes, National Quilting Day. We're going to do a little bit of quilting. We will. We're going to do some free motion quilting. So, not on this one, but another one. <clears throat> I've already changed threads. How's it going? Hello, hello, welcome. Welcome. Hello, 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 proof. Hello, Samantha. Hello, Annie M. Hello, 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 hello. Hello, Cheryl. Bonnie. Hello. Is that Bonnie or Dad? Uh, it's not a quilt, it's a tapestry. Hello, Miss Lois. Hello, Suzanne Taylor. Good afternoon, everyone. How's everybody doing? Mm-hmm. You betcha, Zoomy. What? 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 What did I miss? What did I miss? Or didn't I miss? <laughs> hey, Baze. How's it going? You're all kind of like just zip past there. Hello, Teresa and Sylvia. What's going on? Mm -mm -mm. Yes, the uh, dragons, courtesy of Miss Sylvia back. Her channel is you and me FPP. Uh, are on the long arm. They just didn't get done this week, but uh, they will get done for next week. So they're they're ready to get some uh, little uh, stitching done on it, and that's what was going to be the video. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, hey, Dad, how's it going? Hello, PLR Pat over on Twitch. Thank you very much for your support over there. Thank you, thank you. Hello, Linda Lindsay. How's everybody doing? Hello, Katie Crafts. Love all the hearts and the chats. That's good. Yeah, happy St. Pat's Day. Yep, yep. There you go. Papa's in the chat. Mm -mm. Papa's there in the chat. <laughs> okay, so yesterday we fiddled and we faddled with a little bit of uh, thread painting, okay? 
and we're just going to go desk here for a moment. And we, we sketched something out. You can see I just kind of used a, a I, I used a golden marker knowing I was going to use this kind of thread. And I think the wa marker kind of washes out. At least I hope so. If not, that's okay. I really don't care. Um, so it was just, it was a lesson. And then we did some fun stuff in the hedgehog. And then we worked over on our little mushroom and our snail. And we did some leaves. Okay. So that was uh, just kind of, you know, getting you introduced and maybe encouraging you to try on a little bit of thread painting. We used a variegated thread. Uh, did I put it on or did I put it? Oh, hey. This was the one we used for it. Though you can't really see some of the uh, darker tones in here unless you're like really, really looking at it. So, hello, Shirley. Uh, uh, Lori. Hello, hello. Hello, Charlotte. Uh, hello, two peppers. I know you're handsome. Well, we did one. Allison's waving to everybody. <laughs> mm hmm. Yes, happy St. Patty's Day to all. Hello, welcome, welcome, welcome. So that was a bit of, you know, I will end up at finishing this and it'll end up being a wall hanging, okay? So I'll, I'll end up doing that. But what we're going to work on today's is this one here. And we're going to turn it, we're going to do some more quilting on it. Um, and then we're going to turn it into a project bag. And I have a little zipper and some very much cute little nature fabric that it's going to, and it's directional, we'll make sure we're doing it right. And uh, that'll be the one side. And then I had the leftover chunk here and I'm going to add some gray to the sides and that'll be the inside. Okay. Yes. And that, that'll be our little project bag. Mm, Pop was going on doing, you can't see me with the phone. Okay. <laughs> What's going on over there? <laughs> hmm? actually typing to Twitch chat. Oh, were you? Yeah. <laughs> okay, so let's uh, let's have some fun with this one. Okay. Hope everybody's having a good weekend so far. I'm happy to see you. Okay, not really any pins because I did like a little base stitch with that one. It just went once around. Hello, balloonist. Hello, April Green. Susan Taylor. All right. Uh, we have our teas. We have our teas. Cheers, everybody. Cheers, cheers. That's us. And that's me. <laughs> Tracy Albert says, did you get your new chair? How's Lois? He, I, I think they turned out really cute. Well, so, so far. Like, I, I Thank you, Lois. I really appreciate that. I was having some fun. Um... And I had lots of people. We went, I took the boys, well actually, yeah, I did, I did trick the boys. I took the boys out for breakfast this morning. I drove and I paid. So yeah, I took them out. <laughs> and I got, and I wore my hat out for breakfast in the grocery store. Uh, wherever I went, I wore my hat. She got no comments at yes, all. I did. <laughs> you were there. <laughs> mm -hmm. Hey, stitch me up. What's going on? Oh, pieces and loves and happies. Yep, yep. <laughs> All right. Hey, Pat Ada. Hey, Catherine. Happy to see you here. <laughs> yes, uh, we are very happy to hear it too. That uh, is less, less pain. And I have rubbed um, uh, a tiger balm on his back too, so which, which helps, right? So gets these spots. In. Okay, now. Tracy H says you have a package on the way. Oh. oh. Three to five days. Oh, okay. We got a mailbox now, too. We have a mailbox now. The boys finished it all up. Looks great. Looks great. And it's even got their little numbers up on the top and like a lit sign sort of thing. It's solar powered when we turn it on. Do we have it turned on I so we can see it today? I don't know it's on or off. It wasn't. I thought it was on. a switch. It is. Okay. We pushed the switch, but I don't know where. Oh, because it was sunny. <laughs> because it has been has been not in sun. So. No, that's true. Okay. Well, maybe it'll charge up. Well, and we'll see it tonight. It'd be interesting. <laughs> Should be fun. <clears throat> mm -mm. Hey, Tony, how's it going? Uh, uh, okay, I'm I'm confused. Why the why the package? What's what's happening? What's going on? I don't know. I just hmm? work here. What's the jibby jibby on the skibby skibby? Hmm? Hmm? Why the package, Tracy H? What's going on? Yeah, a mailbox! Yeah! <laughs> I know, right? Those are the moments the peasants rejoice. Okay. 
Uh, what do I want to do first? We kind of want to accent the hedgehog, so we're going to build it out a bit. Build out his body with the variegated thread. So we'll start kind of, I think we'll probably just work down and then come back up and work down and come back up. So that was kind of evening it out a bit. Okay. Hey, Karen Little, good afternoon from Winnipeg, Manitoba. Have you seen Patrick's Day? A mailbox. I know. Yay. <laughs> it is actually kind of nice. He even said like three times. I'm like, oh, sometimes I have a mailbox there. <laughs> I watch we get this massive snowfall. No kidding. I'm kidding. I didn't say that. I didn't say that. <laughs> well, we dug it, dug it out and moved it back. So. Yeah, and, yeah, and it popped. I had to dig it out and move it back too. So, <clears throat> sorry. Mm -mm -mm. I love this Valerie. What's going on? Oh, oh, what did I miss? When I'm uh, not sure how long I'm here for. My neighbors are getting married at 3 p.m. <gasps> oh, nice. Fantastic. Congratulations to them. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. All right. Cheers, everybody. Enjoyed Saturday. Happy St. Patrick's Day weekend. I'm sure Marcus is rate pooped. <laughs> he, he was actually physically working today. Okay. We're going to start up at the top. We're going to drop our thread down. Bring it back up. Make sure we got our tail at the bottom okay that comes up and because this is some really nice variegated thread here I'll show you before we get started so you can see what we're working with here okay that's what we're going to use welcome hope hello 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 I know who hope is but I don't know if she wants to say so that's okay I'll keep it my little secret until she wants to say something <laughs> Happy you're here, Hope. Happy to see you. <clears throat> hey, Patty G. Yeah, I'm, it's actually really nice for... Uh, actually, I was going to offer to pop come work out in the shop because normally he worked... Or not normally, but there's been like one time he worked out here on a Friday. Twice. Was it twice? It's twice, yeah. Oh, that was only once. Oh. So, But with his new chair, I didn't want to take that away from him. <laughs> We'll okay. have to replace this chair. Well, that could be the extra when we actually get a visitor here. So, because yeah. it's it sits well with the desk, right? Yeah. Okay, so I'm just gonna try. I don't know if I'm gonna come close to or stack on top or make a mess or whatever. And I'm just gonna let the thread and the fabric uh, talk, and that's the that's the the best part of it. Uh, make sure your feed dogs are dropped. You got your zero st uh, stitches set to zero, and you control the pedal as well as the hands. And I always try to work in a triangle form to give the most um, structure to what you're working in, and just kind of work in little sections, just like this. Okay. Hello, Claudette. Welcome, welcome. Hello, Nadine. Happy everyone. Saint ha happy. Oh, sorry. Hello, everyone. Happy St. Patrick's Day weekend. Yes, happy, happy. Just around the corner where the, it's, it's feeling like spring today too. It's so nice to actually have some, um, you know, good sunshine weather. It was nice just to sit on the deck and play with Sophie and, you know, just enjoy it. Uh, it's fine to say I forgot my moniker is different here. So, oh yeah, oh, Kelly, there we go. Well, okay. I didn't know. It could be your secret identity. Your superhero. <laughs> One of the things I think I'm going to try uh -oh. is uh, setting up so Twitch chat appears on screen so the YouTube viewers can see the Twitch chat. That would be nice. But we can't do the opposite. No, we can't do Twitch does not allow that. Yeah. Yeah. That's one of Chris's problems. He only did that that amount and then I'm moving I'm shifting my hands and of course I want to make sure my project is in front of me that's going to be the ease of doing it it's, it's great by having a small project that you can flip it any way you need to to have to, to work in the direction you need to okay. so you you're not squeaky today <laughs> thanks ladies for the troubleshooting of why was Nomi squeaking so bad this edition of what the heck's up with the quilt show 
<laughs> Secret identity. I didn't know Craft a simple life. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to ruin it. I don't want to be the one that... Well, I, I had this superhero identity and then Lord Lynn messed it all up. <laughs> And I just did this as a sketch. I, I, I found a photo online. You go and find some hedgehog uh, coloring book pages. And this one actually pops up with like a flower up in his little hands. And I just did like a basic little sketch. You can see I just have some just like dashes of where I thought his fur should come out to. And I just was inspired by that. It's not exactly the same, but it's, it's pretty similar. You could, I'm sure you could find it out there. And then we're going to do this way. So let's turn this around. We'll work on his inside part too. I'm hoping you're having a great Saturday. And happy International Quilting Day. So we are doing some quilting right now, people. Not just sewing. We are quilting. So. If you're not quilting on International Quilters Day, then there's something up. Okay, this is where his ear is. I don't want to make that a curve because then it's going to look like he's got a weird ear. So I have to make sure I'm putting the little jagged stitches to represent the fur those little spikes what is it is it fur or spikes there um pat remish schneider she's had three of them hooper duke and um cactus i couldn't remember the first part precious cactus was that it? i was trying to tell the boys last night i thought i, said, oh, I thought it was really interesting Find a speed that's good for you. And just make sure to, if you're stopping, that you're stopping with the needle down. So when you go to shift your project, you're not like taking it way off from where it's supposed to be. Okay, see there? Stop. For two. Cactus flower. Oh, sorry. Cactus flower. Okay. Sorry. Cheers, everybody. That's me. <laughs> Sorry, just need a moment. <clears throat> back and forth, back and forth. Hand binding the woos a donation quilt. Excellent. That's a beautiful project. I would love to see it with the binding on it too. Because that was you did some pretty colors. Was that a kit? Was that like a jelly roll kit that you used? Because it was very, very much on the like deeper earther tones of uh, color. And I really enjoyed it. I don't necessarily always work with those sort of things or sort of color or palettes like that, but it was really, it was really inspiring. Cheers, me a cup of tea. A cup of tea. <clears throat> yeah, his birthday's on Friday. Yes. Did, was he in the chat? Did he say something? I haven't seen him. Oh, you haven't seen him? Okay. No. He usually is watching on Twitch. Yeah. <clears throat> I did send him a message on Discord, so... You did send him a message? What, to pop in and say hi to, or what? No, just that he was getting birthday wishes. Oh, okay. Well, thank you, everybody, for doing that. It's also um, Kelly uh, Quilts and Cruises. It's her birthday on Tuesday. So if we see her pop in the chat, too, let's make sure to wish her a happy birthday. If she's not here already. I don't remember seeing her. But. Mm -mm -mm. Hello, June Billings. How are you doing today? Greetings. Putting the final stitches uh, in the binding on this baby quilt. Feeling accomplished. High five, Cynthia. High five. Well done, my friend. Kylie's very young and he named Hooper. Uh, Di sorry, Duke was named after John Wayne, of course. <laughs> and, um, and do they have spikes? Sorry, I missed. Oh, spikes. They have spikes. Okay, thank you. I thought, I thought as much. I thought they were spikes. 
because I, I thought they were also related to the porcupines. Dinner just arrived. Be back later. Ooh, what's for dinner? You could take us with you, you know. <laughs> and Justine's birthday is tomorrow. Well, wish her happy birthday. If she if she pops into chat, I, I will sing her happy birthday. <clears throat> and thank you everybody for wishing Marcus happy birthday this week. That's awesome. Remember, cross stitch Tuesday will be on Thursday because uh, Tuesday I have my infusion. Okay. And we'll just do what we can with the videos as we go along. And I know there's no pressure. Everyone is being so productive. I feel like I should get up and work on one of my projects. <laughs> Hop to it, Whiskey. Come on. <laughs> Cocky like it. No I'm kidding. <laughs> So are we gonna do what I thought we were gonna do with this? Uh, you wish. Yeah. So yeah. they can, we can, you can. I can set it up. Is that what you're yeah. asking? Yeah. 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 That's what I would like. I would like. Okay. okay. <laughs> Does hedgehog uh, equal porcupine? I don't know. I think they're they are related somewhere down the line. Fine. I'm just kidding, whiskey. <laughs> Before you go, though, <laughs> we're gonna give this. Uh, hedgehog uh, project bag uh, away so if you're interested in getting it with the stuff I've already shown and me making it then I think you know what you gotta do yeah as soon as pop tells you to <laughs> hey Elizabeth my grandson's birthday is on the 29th he will be 20 very nice my sister Elizabeth's on the 30th and my uh, niece uh, Mackenzie's on the 23rd the day after Marcus is they are one year apart. I was actually hoping my sister Elizabeth was going to pop her, pop her, pop the baby out on uh, Marcus's birthday. Then we would have had a birthday, but nope, she waited till the next day. <laughs> Hello from a very wet Ireland. I can very relate to that, there, Miss Bernadette. I can. I can very much relate to that because we are boggy and soggy and puddles galore. So the sunshine in today has been glorious, absolutely glorious. Playing with the dog. Having, kicking the toy around, having a good time. Okay, uh, people are going to enter the, the giveaway, so save, save any chat till, till you get your enter in. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. You guys are awesome for wishing Marcus a happy birthday. Thank you, thank you. Okay. Yeah, so if you're interested in, in winning this um, pork, I'm sorry, pork pie. I was going to say baby pork pie. <laughs> Not a baby pork pie. It's a, it's a hedgehog. And I'm doing some red, so white. Something's not right with YouTube. Just give me a second. Uh oh, something's not right with YouTube. Give Pop a second, okay? Sorry, 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 sorry. Hey, Arlie. Mm -hmm. Hey, Kate Watson. Hello, Nina. Do do do. Okay, yeah. Give give him a moment. Something, something. Hey, Weird Ann. Mm -hmm. Uh, Twitch is working just fine for their giveaway. Yeah, Twitch is working fine. <laughs> yeah. uh, oh, looks like it might be fixed. Looks like joined, joined, joined. There's lots of them are showing up as joined yeah. now. Okay, so just have everybody, everybody, please just re-enter. Okay. If you were in the first part, oh. I I had to fix it. That's why. Okay. Hopefully you heard pop. And there's no plastic on this one. It's just cloth and fabric, and it's just a little project bag for you to keep stuff in, or, or uh, you know. Or you know a project or or whatever. You just have to store your threads or some rulers or whatever. It should be about 15 by 15, I think. <coughs> Sorry. When we get when we get her about done with it, we're not going to go super duper crazy with it, or will we? Probably will. Pardon? Probably will. Probably will. <laughs> but it's looking kind of cute so far. You kind of see a little face there. Okay. We're just going to try and fill this in with some uh, back and forth and fun stuff, okay? And then I've got my free motion foot on, and I'm trying to definitely just kind of keep a triangle form. We are out about today. Uh, like I said, took the boys out for breakfast, and we had to stop by the grocery store and get Pop's uh, meds because um, they were prescription was finally filled. And 
then we were hopping over to the hardware store to get a new 4x4 for the post for the mailbox. And I saw our neighbor, Sean, in the parking lot. So when I said, hey, I recognize that dog. <laughs> Not that he's a dog. I meant he actually had one of his dogs with him. I realized that sounded bad as soon as it came out of my mouth. Um, so anyways, so he uh, said where he works over at the, the Timber Mart, they had some uh, 4x4s, 12-footers, like on clearance. So, well, <clears throat> we said, oh, sure, we'll head over there. And then we're like, oh, well, there's no way we can have that in the back of the car <laughs> with all of us. So we'll have to get it delivered. And then he showed up right next to us and offered to drive it uh, delivered to the house, which is so, so nice. I love, I love good neighbors, right? Amazing. We're so happy we moved here. Yeah, it's looking cute. <coughs> Sorry, got a frog in my throat. Mm, hey, Linda Parsons. <coughs> and anybody else I may miss coming in? My birthday is this one. Well, happy birthday, Linda Parsons. Justine. Justine's in the chat. Did I miss her? Mm, sure. Bird box message. Oh, there she is. <coughs> Hold on, let me come down and around and then I'll, I'll sing you happy birthday, okay? To all the birthdays this week. <coughs> in a few spots here it's actually lined up color wise as I've gone around because that's pink pink it's white white <laughs> it's actually kind of neat I'm gonna go to the red towards me and there's just a little bit of batting under here there's no backing just a little bit of batting uh, and then we'll just uh, we'll attach it to uh, another chunk to be the inside <coughs> you're 32 tomorrow awesome we'll go mean cam and we'll sing happy birthday <coughs> yes happy birthday out we got lots of birthdays Hey, Mirna. Welcome, welcome. Mm -hmm. uh, I got to try this. Looks so good in black. It does. It really does. Like even the uh, the head, the other hedgehog turned out really nice. It does look nice on on white too, but just on a different level, right? It's just, but the black just kind of makes it pop. It seems like the white is like almost like airy and whimsical, and the black is like seems like dramatic and you know intense to me, anyways. Could be all up here. <laughs> Hello, Paula. Welcome, welcome. All right, so I'm gonna say happy birthday to all the peoples. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Linda, Justine, Kelly, everybody in the chat. <laughs> happy birthday to you and many more. Hope you have a fantastic day filled with loves and hugs. You get spoiled and you get your cake. Uh, Want to hear what uh, Marcus wants for a birthday cake? <laughs> I didn't get a chance to make him one last year, and I felt really, really bad about that. I really did. Um, so, And I didn't want to just make him one random, even though we've had, like, a cake or two <laughs> in between there. But, you know, as for his special birthday cake, I do want, I said, do you want pie? Do you want cookies? Do you want a cake? Like, what do you want? I'm, I, whatever it is, I got it for you, right? So I just needed to be able to plan. <laughs> Yeah, best wishes to everybody celebrating. It looked like one of the cream cheese packages is open. Yeah, there was one extra one. So, yeah, because I wanted it. <laughs> I wanted it all with my bagel. I got my cheese and her bagel. <laughs> but it'll be enough. I think we only need three for the thing. So. Yeah, happy birthday, everybody. And our, our niece, Sarah Lynn, had her birthday on Thursday. Marcus and I sent her a little video singing to her. Hey, Teresa. Hey, Tessa. 
Welcome in. Uh, exclamation enter to enter. And uh, it might be a bag of fluff. Sorry? What kind of tea are you drinking? Uh, uh, my Earl Grey. My, my Earl Grey. I love my Earl Grey. Sorry, that head noise. And then we're going to come back down and work this side. Oops. Did you actually say what type of cake it was? No, I didn't. But I just asked if they wanted to know. Yes. Yeah, yeah, well, I didn't see anybody saying they wanted to know. <laughs> so I was waiting. <laughs> Tell all the story and then... <laughs> I'll take the fluff. I'll take anything. <laughs> okay, so... <clears throat> so, it is a... Hold on. Because I want, I wanted to do it the way he did it, not the way I wanted to do it. So okay. <laughs> so it is a shortbread crust, and then cheesecake with raspberry or strawberry thingy majiggy swirled all through. But he wants the my whipped shortbread, uh, like cookie for, crust for it. So. Or it was going to be the graham cracker crust, because that's how I like my cheesecake. <laughs> but it's not my cake. <laughs> With the cheesecake there, and then the shortbread cookies, like, in it. Like, in the cake. So. And why did he go with cheesecake? And he went with cheesecake because he knew Pop wouldn't eat it. <laughs> and it wouldn't be bad. <laughs> because Pop can't eat it. And can't eat it. It doesn't like cheesecake anyway. It's not his favorite. Though he has found an Oreo cheesecake that he did like. So, uh, Have you made this? I missed about the panel. It just popped off screen. It was above uh, Catherine Softkin. Is that a panel hanging behind you? Or have you made that springy piece? No. It's just a panel from in... Uh, sorry, light in the box is the, the link if you wanted to go check it out. I, it was so popular last weekend. Yeah, so that's the cake I'm going to make. I think it sounds good, and uh, we probably will be sharing it with the neighbor, or at least freezing half of it. <laughs> so. <laughs> I doubt it. Because I certainly don't need to eat it all. I have the same uh, thread, variegated thread, wound in the bobbin, too.
<laughs> oh, what's Jesse and my dad is make, uh, taking me out for dinner tonight? Oh, very nice. Love cheesecake. <laughs> it does sound good. Hey, Sandra, how you doing? Uh, you know, he knows I'm, I'm pretty much capable of uh, making anything he could probably want. And, and I feel like I owe it to him for just being so sick last year and not being able to do anything. Didn't even get to enjoy his bir a birthday meal with them. <laughs> that was the saddest thing. Now this little guy is holding a flower. And we'll stitch one out. It may be a flower we look know or something new and weird and wonderful. <laughs> However it turns out. Spiky one. Sorry honey? A spiky one. A spiky one. <laughs> And then we'll go around and do his little face again here, and we'll come up and do his finish his flowers, and then he'll be done. Okay. <clears throat> hey, Steph, how you doing? How's you and Mark? How's it going? How's the fam jam? Mm -mm 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 -mm. I'm making shepherd's pie tomorrow to celebrate anniversary. Oh, fantastic! I love hedgehogs. I just bought a bolt of two of the pink hedgehog fabric. They make me smile. <laughs> hey, whatever makes you happy, girlfriend. Whatever makes you happy. Cheers. <clears throat> that was it was a challenge to our, ourselves well from the from the chat was what what could I thread paint next and the hedgehog was it so now the question is what should I head paint head, head, what should I thread paint next <laughs> what's the options we've done two animals a seahorse and um, uh, a hedgehog and I do have a gray and white variegated one I would love to play with uh, doing so I, th I thought about doing like a ghosty ship uh, Trace, uh, sorry, Lori Clark's um, uh, cross stitch that she's working on kind of inspired me for that. It's like, ooh. I want to leave it a little. Gotta give him a little pokey poke pokes up at the top here. Uh, exclamation enter to enter. We're giving this guy away. I'm making him into a project bag and we're giving him away. Okay. Or, or, or bag. It's just a zippered bag. You know, when, whatever you want to do with it is up to you. Okay. Just give a special quilting attachment that works on all machines. Uh, it's called a, um, free motion foot and most machines, if it's more than just a basic straight stitch or a zigzag stitch machine, like a little, a couple of extra feet, they usually will have one like this. There is short shanks and long shanks. And that just means the, your, your distance here on your machine. So you may have the same, but it might be like a couple springs shorter, right? So that'd be a short shank. If you do a black background, a white flower, yes. Oh, like a big mandala flower there, whiskey. Is that what you're thinking? Because I haven't done one of those. That would be that would be a challenge to try and get everything nice and even up and straight. Ooh, I like that. I like that. I like that. I like that a lot. Mm -hmm. Hey, guess who, Nancy? How's everybody doing today? If I missed you, hello. Neon mushrooms, aren't they neat, Paula? <laughs> I, I love this this wall hanging. I originally found the site for Marcus to find something to take uh, to cover his walls downstairs, and I said, oh, you know, I'd love one of these to quilt up. I think it would look really funky, you know, Trapunto the mushrooms and 
you know, the rocks and stuff like that, and then just like really densely quilt around the background in like matching thread or something like that. So that was the original idea. I had had a couple of backdrops for some Long Arm Wednesday shows or videos, um, and then uh, I had it on the wall to do the dragons that uh, Miss Sylvia designed. Uh, her her uh, channel is You and Me FPP, and it is a fantastic place to hang out and learn. And she does a couple of collabs with Miss Melissa, Miss Practically Creative. They do some fun stuff over there. So you should check out both their channels. And thank you again, Miss Sylvia, for doing that. I hope, I hope we've had lots of downloads for it. Okay, I wanna I guess I wanna do my, my my front of my flower first, then I can figure out where my sticks are going. My bottom part here. Okay, so I'm gonna come up here. I only have two lines, so that's my guidance. I only got two lines and my batting stops at about here, so I can't be any crazy crazy flowers. Do you want a quilt or something, honey? To help to cushion? Okay. Right. <coughs> I, I understand. Well, we can do the draw before you go, okay? So no worries about that. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, that would be cool. Okay. Hey, it's not a bad idea. Sorry. Come here for a second. So, yeah, happy happy St. Patrick's Day weekend, everybody. Uh, dishwasher running inside, dog running outside, Wayne is running errands. Time for me to sit. There you go. <laughs> Pop, where's your hat? Actually, I think it went in the house, didn't it? Yeah, I went in the house. So, do we know if Marcus is in the chat? I haven't seen him. Hmm? Probably went to go lay down. I wanted to show. I want... channels called? What channels? Um, oh. You and me FPP. Oh, you and me FPP. They're over on uh, YouTube side though. Whiskey sarcasm. Okay. You, me, and FPP. You, me, FPP. You, me, FPP. But there's an and in there. Her, her at symbol is you, me, FPP. Okay. And the other one is, um, hold on, uh, practically creative. Okay. She's and she's also over on uh, YouTube side. Yeah, we're just new. We're new to Twitch side there, there, Whiskey. Uh, we've been on YouTube for about seven years, though. So. Okay, so I'm going to kind of try and come up and build my little flower. Figure out what kind of flower I want first. I'll just wing it. I like winging it. I give myself a base, like the base kind of sketch out of the hedgehog, and then we'll go from there, right? So. How is my sister Lisa tell her? I will, I will. Uh, she popped in, uh, what was it, the Tuesday before uh, on the Facebook, but and she was working from home. But she keep, she's keeping busy, which is good. I keep her out of trouble, you know. Oh, there we go. Okay. Build on her little stem. Sometimes you just have to find that happy speed, right? And it's not, I know sometimes, oh, I'm just going to go pedal to the floor. It's not always that way, though. <laughs> it's a usually a good, you know, runner-up, right? Oh, you found them? Excellent. Thank you, Whiskey Sarcasm, for going to following their channels. I really appreciate that. Hi, so Terry. Hi, Ellen Chatters. Hope Kent is feeling better. He is. He is. Yeah. 
Yeah, he is. A little bit. I love roses too, uh, but they are a bit more uh, maintenance. Yes, they are. I, and their and they're bushes too. Hey, Lena. Hey, Elizabeth. Are you sneakings in there? Yeah, we have a giveaway today. Uh, exclamation entered enter. Uh, you're entering to win this. We're turning it into a project bag. It's a cute little hedgy hog. Okay, just a fabric one. No plastic. Just plain zipper on top. I was going to say nothing exciting, but by golly, it's exciting. Don't you kid yourself, it's not exciting. It's exciting. You need a new project bag? <laughs> they are so handy for so many little different things. Like when Pop traveled, he took the small iron and uh, an emoji. I made a few emoji bags, so he, he's now that the small iron is now in the emoji bag with all it needs. Right? So. You know, and then this is a little that bag, and you know, Sophie stuff is all in this little bag. You know, it's actually they're so they're really handy dandy. Put a little handle on it, put a little strap on it, you know, whatever whatever you need it to be, right? It's kind of a cute little flower. Let's do a little bit more in the center part. Oops, I feel like we fluffed. No, we're not fluffed. A cute little flower. Oh, you're welcome. So, Terry, anybody have any questions? Any any questions at all? You know? Yes, thank you. Thank you. It was also you. Uh, we got some deals on gardenias and jasmines recently. I can't wait for them to bloom. I really want to get um, uh, a, a lilac or two. The question is where to plant it that it's not going to drown itself, right? I may have to put it in a bed, like in, or get a big pot or make a big pot for it. So, I appreciate our community helping other people in our community. So that is, that is awesome. Guys. Because I'm always trying to keep my hands in like a triangle form so I have the best control right in between my index fingers and my thumbs. weekend so happy mother's day uh belated i didn't i didn't realize it until i think it was tracy provis uh so, so what her daughter got her from um um for mother's day and i was like oh oh right right i forgot it was in march i forget it's in march until you know somebody reminds me <laughs> yeah. but that threw me off so much i think our first year there because my mom's birthday is like May 14th and it was always near Mother's Day so when all the Mother's Day stuff started coming out I thought oh my gosh I missed my mom's birthday <laughs> I had a couple months it was okay 
I was like, whew, panic attack. I was like, wait a second here. And that's when I was like, oh, they celebrate it differently. But Father's Day's the same. Go to the other side of their hand. Got a couple pretty little flowers there. Just, uh, just got trip to Culture, uh, uh, Uxerter, Uxerter, and May. Oh, uh, lilacs are inviting my lawn, uh, inv or invading my lawn from the neighbors. Uh, don't not fond of them really. I didn't realize they were an invasive species like that because the one at the side of the house was just the same. It was the only lonely little plant like before. It depends on the type. The, oh, okay. Okay. They will bush and they will drop seed. Oh yeah. Yeah. Uh, 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 uh. Here in Florida, lilac bushes seem to uh, head for water lines and drainage system. They eventually have to pull. Oh really? Oh, that's not good. And I like to try and line up our little sticky sticks. Just need to come in and do the eye, and I think we're good to go. So let's uh, raise our needle and find our snips. Do do them. Go to the main camera, please. Thank you. <coughs> yes, lilacs are deadly to you. Hey, Sharon, how you doing? Welcome, welcome. You will need to plant your lilacs in the ground. They grow fast and up and end up being the bush. Okay, hold on. You will need to plant your lilacs in the ground. They grow fast and end up being being a bush. Okay. I, I like them there. Maybe maybe along the fence line or something. But then I don't want the cows to eat them either. I broke thread just so I could uh, come in and stitch the eye part here, okay? Do you alter tension? Uh, I don't touch anything. I don't touch anything that I would of a normal machine. So, sorry to ask, but me already... That's, that's oh, okay, sorry. No, 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 hey, no, ask questions, please do. Please do. Uh, that's what we're here for, you know, to help help you learn. I don't touch any of the. T I just drop the feed dogs, turn my stitch to zero, and have my f foot on, and then just go with the flow. I feel a bit chilly, but I don't really want the heater on. <laughs> it's not too bad in here. Okay, so let's get the stitching of the eye done, and then we can start making our bag. Okay. Oh. Just gonna try and do like an intense little spot here, like the nose. Is your entire 
design freehand or did you draw it somehow? I drew some of it. I just did like a little tiny sketch. There was like a little, because I saw there might have been a mark there. And there's a little, like a little dash here. It's just like I kind of gave myself like the basic little idea. I didn't do any of the zigzag. I just did like little dashes of where I figured he should be or go. So, um, but if you go and Google hedgehog coloring books, one pops up just, just almost like this. Like, or, or this, uh, that's what I use as my reference. But I kind of just, you know, I don't think his ear's in the right spot or something. Or it's, I have a bigger ear or what have you. So, and I don't think I put his foot in. I just did the little curve for the hand. So. Is that enough? I think that's enough. Okay. Right. But uh, free coloring books, pages online, or even coloring 99 cent coloring books from the dollar store or something like that. Uh, and or be inspired by your uh, niece, nephew, grandkids, art. You know, who wouldn't want if they, you know, their little art on the side of a library bag, right? Or a little bag that they go to Nana, Grandma, Auntie, Uncle's house sort of thing, right? So here's, here's our little buddy. See him over. Oh, there we go. Do, 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 do. Cute enough? Well, thank you, Tracy. Hey, hey, Jean. Exclamation enter to enter. We're turning this into a little project bag. And we're giving it away. I need to do a skunk. <gasps> that would be perfect with the grays. And maybe accent of black. Oh, Jackie, you may have that. Oh, Jackie. Mm -hmm. what, kind gonna... of, what kind of thread are you using? Uh, it is a, hold on, I left the case on the gray one so I could show. Oh, here it is, okay. Because we were asked yesterday. It's Marathon Rayon Thread. Oh, hold on, let's focus. It doesn't say a weight on it, so I can't tell you the weight. Okay, so it's a marathon rayon thread. It is an ombre gray for this one. Is it thicker than your quilt, uh, like your long arm thread, or is it about the same? Uh, it's about the same. So it's probably a 60? Yeah. And it, this one has a lovely little color to it, so. And, and doing a skunk with that, that's a good idea, Jack. Yeah, exclamation! If if you want the you know a uh, little cute little hedgehog project egg, so yeah, so yeah, that with a little bit more black accent and on a skunk would be totally cute. Maybe, maybe. I like doing them. Okay, I'll show you the one that we finished, or not finished yesterday, but we were working on yesterday. Oh. That was the inspiration for the learning how to or teach you to the thread de paint, but I'm just gonna turn this one into wall hanging because it's way too big for a project bag. <laughs> so yeah, I got too excited and made it big. So that's the that's the first hedgehog we did. And then I did this one with a little bit of like mushroom and snail and stuff. It needs more work. You can see how I sketched it out. There's a sketch there and I haven't hit all my lines going up with the thread, but I'm not done yet. I just kind of did the base base. I'm pretty much done with the, this guy. Needs some uh, leaves to do and a little bit more on the flower and stuff. So yeah, so that's what we did yesterday. Okay. But I'll just turn that into a, uh, like a wall hanging or something cute or maybe like a big pillow or something. Right. So and that was just, you go and look up a hedgehog. He looks very similar to this. And, and then I found another picture that I liked with the mushroom and a snail on top. And I just put that together and I just did a little sketch and whammo bammo. So actually, lap, lap quilt, hold on. I don't know, maybe, maybe. Actually, you're, you're right on there, Whiskey. It would make a nice little lap one just to, you know, oh, for the car. For the car when we go driving. <laughs> and Pop hangs his head. He's like, I'm out. <laughs> Can't handle her no more. <laughs> okay, let's trim this one. Uh, actually, let's iron. 
and switch our foot out because we don't need our free motion foot no more. We need our regular thread and our uh, walking foot. Mm. Well, thank you, Jenny Anderson. I appreciate you saying that. I have, I have a lot of fun, and uh, I think that's really the main point of life. Right? Just having fun. And making friends. And eating cake. <laughs> And somehow I lost my little screwdriver, so I had to borrow yours, Pop. So. <laughs> Just so you know. Somehow. I don't, I literally, I did, when I went to put the mat on the desk yesterday, I was like, uh, where is the root foot? I mean, the little, because I had it. I know I had it. Could do your dog on a jacket? I could. I could. I already have plans for a jacket, though. I already got plans for a jacket. Not derail the plans, okay, Tony? <laughs> Future. Future. And I think if I did that, I would probably do the pets I had as portrait on the back. Like we'd do our dog Zeba, our uh, cat Mr. Clive. You know, that sort of thing. Do like a little portrait thing. That would be interesting. I don't think I'm that talented though. I was, I'm only kidding, Tony. I'm only kidding. <laughs> I'm only kidding. It's all good. Now I'm going to use uh, my half square triangles. Uh, I've already got a jacket pattern picked out. Um, I just have to put the pattern together. Do some, some uh, taping, cutting and taping. I think she's streaming tomorrow there, Whiskey, but I'm not sure. Let, I'll let her to see when, when she's streaming. I, th I thought it was Sunday on her... her uh... I did! I did, Paula. After many moons of waiting, patiently, I finally got it. And yes, I got the biggest one of the Martelli. It doesn't fit the desk completely. It stops here, but I have a little chunk of a extra green mat that I've taken out like for road trips and stuff. So it is helping even out the rest of Nomi on the board here. And, he's, and I still got like another inch on the side, so. Right. What you doing there, bub? Planning. Pardon? Planning. Planning, okay. <laughs> Okay, so what I want to do here is trim, trim this to, oh no, first I need to uh, add, add gray. I need to add gray to this side. Okay. Noon Sunday. Okay, so noon, so that's one my time. Okay. Usually the boys and I are playing a game, but I try to, try to hang out. Hey, little Tracy Provis, how you doing today? What you laughing at there, Barbara Kate? What you laughing at? <laughs> okay, so I'm going to add a little gray on either side and that should be enough to uh, make out um, the, uh, this will be the inside. This will go on the inside of the bag. Just need a little bit either side. Oh, 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 no, help us if you have the right stitch. Don't be crazy. And your hat isn't in the way. Uh -huh. What? Helps if your hat isn't in the way. Uh oh. Yeah, maybe we should take it off for a smidge. Only while sewing. I'm sorry? Shady Susan's birthday today. Oh, awesome! Happy birthday, Shady Susan! I have lots of birthdays today. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Shady Susan. Happy birthday to you. And many more. I hope you have a fantastic day filled with loves and hugs. 
fluffy stuff. Do you got a big plans? What's your, what's your, what's your pretty cake? Okay, we just need to iron that. And trim this. Do, do. I think the batiks would be okay for the the dragon there, Nina. Just uh, they are a little bit tougher to sew through, uh, as well as I think you you have the versatility of the batik. It could go either way, right? You could you could put it one way or you could put another. Mo most of them, anyways. You may may have one of those ones that it's actually definable, but uh, I would think they would be okay. Yeah, and, and yeah, what, what Sylvia said, it would look awesome. Yeah. Definitely give it that extra body and, and um, like, life you're looking for, right? Pop those off to the side. That's going to be our inside. So it'll be like this. And this, and then we have this and this for the other side, and a zipper on top, just like that. Okay, right. so let's measure out. Fit right in there. Perfect. Lots of room all the way around. Wonderful. You sound like a nailer. <laughs> Didn't she? She sounded like... Sophie, I thought you were going to explode. <laughs> you see the, the look on her face. Her eye was all scrunched up in the side of her nose. <laughs> I was like, what just happened here? <laughs> okay. Um, first, let's try and get on either side. Let's cut it. 15, so we got a little bit of below and a little bit above and a little bit around and give him a hug. Okay, uh, cut ya. Cut ya, cut ya, cut ya. Na, 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 cut ya. Okay, so let's... Yes, Lynn, that was Sophie. Yeah, that was Sophie. She was sneezing. I thought, I thought she was going to explode. Okay, and then, where, okay, where's all the, okay, I'm not cutting this fabric up as I cut. <laughs> I've done that before. I'm sure I'm not the only one. Okay. And then we're going to try and even her out. A little bit before, a little bit after. So we're trying to frame her out. Him, her, it, them, they, whatever. Right. Here. It's okay. Okay. 
And there we go. Kind of sectioned her out a bit. Hold on, let's zoom out a bit. Okay, sort of that. Okay. See where she's going to sit in the center there? We'll just do a little measure, measure. Thank you, so uh, Shelly Sews. I appreciate that. I had a lot of fun making her. I mean, she's really cute. And the reason why I put uh, batting under there is you can even see already with just the quilting, it kind of pulls it in a bit. So you want to use some sort of a stabilizer fabric or, or batting or something to be able to have it all stitch onto. And I mean, even just the, the inside's almost just as cute, right? Like, so you could do it on both sides like I have done with this, this one here, the seahorse head, right? I did top and bottom and stitched it through like a sandwich. So it's, it's great from both sides, right? Hey, Kathleen Champ, how you doing today? Okay, so now let's trim. Trim, trimity, trim, trimity, trim, trim, trimmeroo. Trim up our little hedgehog and give her a room. With a zipper. Exclamation enter if you would like to chance to uh, win this bag, this project bag. Okay. Super cute. Okay. And then we've got a little zipper. And this will be our inside fabric. Okay, with a little bit of gray on it. It just needed to be just a smidge because it wasn't quite wide enough. I'll have to trim this, which is okay. And then here is our other side. Okay. Ah, thank you, Tracy Provis. Not as cute as your cross-stitched one, though. <laughs> but it is kind of adorable. Give them flowers for you. <laughs> okay, so it's pretty simple. Uh, we'll attach this here to this side, so when flipped out. And then we'll attach that onto the other side. And then we'll just do the same. Boom, boom. Okay. Cheers, everybody. Here we'll go this one. There. And I'm making with squirrels on. This would be, it, oh, and that way you can literally design it to suit the needs, right? Howdy, working on scraps I got from a state. Oh, very nice. I mean, scraps. Never again. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> hey, Kelly, cool. It's a cruise. I sang happy birthday to you earlier. <laughs> uh, fun idea for a bag. I have to make five more nautical bags for September. Friends. For yes, there you go. Very cool. Very cool. That's nice that you're making them a bag, too. I think that's pretty awesome. Oh no. Oh no, Whiskey Sour Sarcasm says, Oh my god, I hate it when the first start uh, to crochet project and the first rows aren't stable when you're trying to get the hook on. Yes, that's, I always said to my nieces when, to not to be discouraged, the first, the first parts are the hardest parts. So, okay, I want to make sure my mushrooms and my nuts are going the same way as my hedgehog when we go to put this zipper in. But I want to trim this up to 15 by 15 first. No space, Karen Doe. Uh, yeah, no, no space there, Karen Doe. Just, just the exclamation, enter, enter. Okay, just a smidge on each side. Get your nuts in order. I'm trying to get my nuts in order. They're the right way. Well, they're actually upside down right now, but that's okay. They'll be better in a moment. <laughs> Who's giving me a hard time about my nuts? <laughs> okay. <laughs> P 
people. Okay, so if I did this, then flipped, my nuts are right. Okay. So let's do this side. Do some little pin 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 in. <laughs> Tracy Rovis. <laughs> I thought it was just Bob saying that. <laughs> it wasn't me at all. I was just repeating it. <laughs> uh oh, what did I sit on? Oh, the iron mat. <laughs> I was like, oh no! <laughs> it didn't crunch, so that's okay. <laughs> Yeah, right? <laughs> Lois is sharing her nuts. <laughs> yeah, so far so good on the chair part. Yeah. Okay, just a simple zipper. Nothing too fancy, McPancy or anything like that. Just... Actually, did I have... I think I had... I wanted to do this in each corner just... To make the ends. Did I want to do that? I think I did. I think I did. I wanted to do a little bit of this on either side. Just kind of spiff it up a bit, you know. Taking it to the next level. Taking it to the next level, you know. So it wasn't just a plain, plain thing. I'm a bobbin. Had something going on. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. Yes, Kelly uh, had a video uh, a live yesterday too. So. Hopefully people were watching and helping and support her too. And I'm sorry for when I did it. I just want to do a little base to get it on there first. And it gives us something to sew through too confidently without making sure we're going to hit any of our metal bits. We don't want the metal bits. PG, ladies, PG! <laughs> okay. Let's do it on this side, too. <laughs> we didn't need all of it. We just needed some of it. Just taking a little bit, folding it. It's actually binding. I'm just taking it and reusing it. Into here. Uh, yeah, that's good. This guy told them too. Well, I, 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 sorry, I asked them too. I asked, I said, hey, listen, Kelly's streaming at this time. This is normally her time, and I'm really sorry I'm stepping on her toes. If you go show her some love, please. Hello, Sister Lisa. Pat Eden was talking about you, or asking about you. So, uh, he says Claire's on her way over to hang out at my sewing room for a bit. Yay! I'll let you know when she is here watching. Uh, you can give, uh, do a shout I would totally give her a shout out. That's my great niece. My sister Lisa's granddaughter. Baby Claire. Lots of people remember do, me doing the air balloon uh, for Claire, too. So, Mom, I will have a hit. No, <laughs> I just teased. I just teased Tracy. <laughs> it's all good. <laughs> it's all good. It's all good. Okay, we'll just tidy that up. Now we're going to put it in. We're going to unzip it halfway first. There we go. Lots, lots to sew to and nothing in the way. Okay. So we're going to stitch along the top here. Okay. These two. So then I'm going to flip this one over to the other side. And then we'll add the other two pieces onto here. Okay. And then we'll sew the outside and the inside, except for a little pouch, and turn it right side, or um, gap, sorry, and then right side out. Let's stop procrastinating and go sew my rows together. Oh, <laughs> okay, Miss Pat Schneider. We'll yell real loud if you win, okay? <laughs> See, I think I want to... Actually, do I want to stitch it down one first and the other? No, I think I'll do it at the same time. Okay. 
And if you're uh, nervous about working with zippers and stuff like that, all I can suggest is just doing like a base stitch uh, before you put it under the machine so you don't have to use the pins, okay? Because pins, pins, can, pins get a little, um, you know, in the way sometimes, right? And you do have to adjust the zipper head as you go. Because even that little bit is actually pulling on the zipper part, right? You can see how it's actually moved out of the way. We want to move it kind of back in the way so we can pinch it in between. There they is. Okay. Waiting for the time the boys are taking me to eat hot pot. Can't wait. Oh, nice. Nice. Hot pot. That's kind of, I'm assuming that's kind of like maybe like a, like, a, like noodles and pork and chicken and stuff like that. Kind of get this Mongolian kind of feel to it, but I know it's probably not that. Okay. So there. Be one side. Cute little hedgehog bag. <laughs> I'm just getting delayed. The nemesis of uh, every sewer, zippers and armholes. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, a double-sided tape too. There we go. Yeah, it's great. And some people even glue theirs too in. I've, I've heard them about gluing, but I'm like, it'd have to be like a pretty tough glue to stick that in, so. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, so let's sew that. And just regular stitch, 2.4. Four miles of binding. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, I need to make one of those blocks for my still secret go. Oh. <laughs> Wait, blocks? What, 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 what? You could put a zipper foot on, but I find uh, working with the walking foot is just fine too. So, okay, just do a little back stitch. And I want to make sure you're sewing nice and even. Okay, the zipper head is right here. I'm going to get a little closer. And I'm going to lift my foot up, reach in between the layers. And I'm going to try and move the zipper head, as soon as I can feel it, back to where I've already sewn. Okay. Might have to do a little push and pull, and maybe even get that third arm out. Move it out of the way. Okay. That way you know you can just keep on trucking to the other side. And happy Saturday to everybody. We got some fun plans. I said I took the boys out for breakfast this morning. Wore my shamrock hat all proud. Okay, now let's do the other side. Let's pop our oops, pins in there. And I love my love, I love my new mat. I haven't cut too many things on it. But so far, so good. And, okay. There we go. And now I'm going to want to get either do the other side or do the top stitching on one side first. But you do want to kind of do a little top stitch to make it pretty. Oh, we have a little fold there. Okay, we're going to fix that. There is a little fold right there. Okay. So seam ripper, it somehow got in there. But that's okay, we'll figure it out. Oh, right there. Right there. Okay, we'll just give it a little bit on either side and see if we can get it to lay flat. Oh, 
that we're not gonna have them. We should be okay. Yeah. Just have to get it flat enough. Let's move the zipper completely out of the way down over on this side. I'm just trying to pull the fabric up and lay it flat. that part there. Oh, we could just give her a go. Oops. Okay, try and line up her stitches from where we were previously. So we don't have like a new line of stitching. So maybe put our hand underneath a little bit, give it the ourselves the best chance. Make sure things are flat. See how we come, how we turn down. Right. Tiniest little tiny thing there. Could probably get it to lay flat with the top stitching. I think we'll be fine. Okay. Now the next one, and we will we will press this too. Okay. Now we want to make sure our nuts are going the right way, and if we well, if we do, hold on, hold on, hold on. it's gonna go on this side. This is gonna be the in. That's going to be the out. Okay. Um, and just to make sure, what we'll do is we'll pop a few pins in and then we can flip it to make sure it's going to be the right way. Okay. And this is only because it's directional fabric. Okay. Like these aren't like forever pins here. They're just to make sure I'm doing it correctly. Okay. So this will be flipped. This will be flipped. Okay. Trees up, nuts down. Bring it up. Trees up, nuts down. Okay, we're good. No, we'll just repin it better. Better. We'll do better. Hey, Andrea. Welcome into the chat. I need to make a batch of sauce before... Of, oh, but I need to clear up my kitchen first. <laughs> what kind of sauce do you make there, Whiskey Sarcasm? It's purple. I love purple. What's purple? What's purple? What, what? Purple. Oh. You're mad. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's yellow on the other side, too. The same yellow as the, the text here. Um, uh, but the, the text is actually blue, I think. I wanted the purple side up. Purple? <laughs> uh, Marinette, oh, there we go, nice, nice. Very narrow meat. That's a good sauce. Thought maybe you're talking like a barbecue sauce or something like that. Come here, you. Why you? Why you? Why you do that? Now we we tuckered the uh, the the Sophie out. That's why she's not um, like awake. <laughs> For one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's she's out. She's out like a light. <laughs> we have, we have we have tuckered her out. It was so nice to be able to play outside today. The boys were working on the mailbox. I was playing with Sophie and being a good fetcher. Uh, fetch me this and fetch me that and whatever was needed. Less steps for for them to make, right? Just when they're working so hard to rebuild our whole mo mo mailbox. 
I, did, I thought that we could reuse the 4 by 4 but it was so munched away and broken. It was actually broken all the way. Uh, it just didn't, it didn't look until you got close up. So Okay, so we're going to stitch across that. Okay. Big batch of green. Oh, that's nice. That's a good idea. That's a good idea. Watching Wild Quilton. Hope everyone's having the best day. I hope you are too. Cheers, everybody, for hanging out with me today and Pop and Sophie and Munchkins in the house. Probably napping. <laughs> we tired yeah. him out too. Yeah, we tired him out too. <laughs> I don't think he's in the chat. I hope he's not, because I want to wear something real quick. Hey, Rebecca. Good choice on the purple side. Yes, I, I, I and I like yellow, too, which is kind of nice. So. so we all, all know it's Munchkin's birthday coming up, right? And the idea when I made this hat, okay, was to make a birthday hat, right? I was like, okay, and I know his, he might be watching. I hope he. Well, I don't know. <laughs> if you're watching, close your eyes. Yeah, if you're watching, close your eyes. Okay, <laughs> I'll tell you when you could open them. <laughs> okay, so uh, and then th the idea came up about uh, making a birthday hat. So it's big because it's gonna fit him, and him got a big head. So I used my rainbow panel. I made him a birthday party top hat. Okay, and I put green under the rim and put a little band on there too. And then just quilt it on the lines. There you go. Got the party hat. <laughs> it is a Martelli, yep, it is. Uh, and, uh,. <laughs> So yeah, so now he's got his own party top hat that he can wear because it's big on me, so it should fit him. And this one was a little bit big on me too, but I put the band in and that helped. That helped as well, right? So, and I wore it all out for breakfast this morning and in the grocery store, everywhere. You need one too? <laughs> Charlotte Banjo's like, I want one. <laughs> hey, it was a great way to use that panel, that rainbow panel, made a hat. Made a hat. Come on. Who wouldn't want a potty hat? <laughs> All right, get to work. <laughs> I hope he loves it. Pins here. <laughs> it's a nice potty hat. The thing is, we all have the, uh, different noggin boggins, so mine's the smallest, so. <laughs> I know, right, Rebecca? Thank you for saying that. Okay, I'm going to up on the zipper head, so let's move it. We don't want to close it completely, though it's not sealed up all around, so it's not a big deal if we did, so. But um, let's lift the foot. You can watch again. You can watch again. <laughs> it's good. Your hat's in the way. I'm oh, sorry. Need that. It's the third third arm needing moment here. There we go. So one of the very few times I wish we had a third hand. Oops. Dealing with zippers. I just wish the hat was. I'm sorry. I just wish your hat. <laughs> One, he has questionable taste, and two, you have my address. <laughs> Very much there, Miss Kelly. A. <laughs> That's funny. She liked my potty hat. <laughs> and I thought maybe if, if I did them like to sell, at least make the inside band a little like an elastic so it could fit all hats, right? You can make a like a potty hat. Potty, potty, potty hat. Okay. okay. So now we're going to take our insides and put them together and our outs. Oh, no, we go top stitch. Top stitch the zipper down. Don't forget. Top stitch the zipper down. See, and then those two little bits that we added on the end, 
with just enough to cover the gray parts of the zipper and still tie in with the whole thing. So top, top stitching. Let's see if we can get this some heat loving. Wait for it to heat up though. Okay. I hope so. Thank you. Well, thank you, Suzanne. I appreciate that. <laughs> candles on it. I'm not, it might be pretty flammable if that happens. <laughs> Maybe uh, like a battery operated one. Kind of cool idea. Yeah. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, that nice rainbow one. Big party, right? Party, party, party. <laughs> you can imagine and create too there, Suzanne. You can. Just think outside the box. Sometimes it gets you into trouble though. <laughs> and that, ow, that's when you can say, you know, mom said I could. Oops, sorry, wrong one. Sorry, wrong one. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Bunch of nubs around here working the place. <laughs> yeah, I thought the cute little fabric matched, you know, where the hedgehog comes from. The cute little forest, right? So, and I just did a cut of fabric of uh, the width of the fabric, 15 inches. And that's why this one was at least a little bit shy. So I added some gray on either side. Harder, not harder door. Now, when the, remember, the next stream won't be until Thursday. Uh, it'll be cross stitch Thursday again this week, okay? Because I've got the, that thing I got to do on Tuesday. So, yes, right, base. <laughs> Had to find the perfect place. The best spotters for the bummers. <laughs> maybe, maybe, maybe some people think in a box. Some, some, some don't. <laughs> Let's do some top stitching. Let's do a fancy stitch here. Oh, can we? Mm, no, we got a, whole, a single whole stitch plate on there, so we have to do it together. Oh, what's a box? <laughs> Something that contains your ideas. Oh, this has got to go. I'm at an hour. Bye-bye. You too. Big hugs, Miss Lois. Uh, Wednesday, still Zoom, okay, that I know of. Uh, I may not work on what we're working on. I may just like, you know, whatever. We'll figure it out. But Wednesday is still Zoom, okay? Zoom for the members and the subscribers. There is a Zoom on Wednesday. Um, I have Claire's, here. Claire's here. Hello, Claire. Hello, Claire. Great Auntie Laura Lynn and Uncle Kent say hi. And happy St. Patrick's Day. Hi, Claire. Big hugs to mom and dad. I hope you have a good time with grandma. 
sewing in the shop. I'm making, I'm making a hedgehog bag. I painted that with thread. Do you think you could do that one day? <laughs> Maybe. I'm happy you're hanging up today. Uh, oh, I changed your foot. Yes, I did. Uh, the plate. Yes, I did. Okay, let's do two ziggity zag. <laughs> Thank you, Tracy Provis, and saying hi to Claire. Okay, I'm just going to try and balance it in between the, like, but staying on the, the one fabric here, okay? Probably could have done it a bit bigger. But we're already in, so. <laughs> Sorry? Too late now. Yeah. She's just smiling, looking at you. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> Uh, <clears throat> she hasn't seen me in a long time, and we, and we look very similar there, Sister Lisa, so. Are you filming Dragons this weekend, or this week? Uh, the Long Arm Wednesday? Yeah. Yes, yep, yeah. yep, yep, yep. It was supposed to be that this Wednesday there, Sylvia, but I missed it. So, sorry. Body had other decisions. Okay. Yeah, they're on the long arm right now. Uh, they look really good, too. Right. There. And then we have a little top stitch here. A little bit closer for a moment. some more. Hold on. Back, back, back. Abort mission. Abort mission. There we go. There we go. Now up. Fighting with zippers. Not a fun thing to do. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> okay, go, it goes up like two little teethies at a time. <laughs> ah! Okay. Miss Helly? Mm -hmm. Is that what we're talking Yeah. She's just taking a little break from uh, YouTube and stuff like that. She, she said she, she might be hanging out in the background, and she really appreciated all the love that we shared last weekend to her. So if we want to toss some more hearts in chat for Miss Helly, that would be awesome of our community, knowing that she's thinking about, we're thinking about her. Okay. Now I'm just going to put the insides and the outsides together. Thank you. Thank you, Whiskey Sarcasm. Let's just take, taking a little break. Okay, now we got our inner and our outer. And we're just going to sew them and we're going to leave a gap on the inside, usually on the side of our pouch, uh, where we're going to just, um, we'll be able to turn it right side out, okay. Yeah, it's just going to do some quilting around them and like maybe kind of stitching. Oh, oh my gosh, it took forever to rip some of the paper out. Oh my. I, for, I forget that about uh, FPPing. <laughs> it's the paper. The endless paper. Thank you, everybody, for sharing the hearts for Miss Ellie. Can we show, guess who Nancy's, please? Sorry. Can we show, guess who's Nancy's, please? It's not showing up because it's just show or hide. It's held for review. 
I'm not logged into YouTube, so. Okay, then I, I could have clicked it. You just had to say that. <laughs> but I will be shortly. Mm -mm. I think Florence, yeah, yeah, actually, we're going to have the draw. We might as well have it. So, uh, got last chance to get in to uh, win this uh, little hedgehog as a project bag or whatever bag. And thank you for sharing the love, people. Uh, you take care there, too, Miss Nadine. Big hugs to you. Uh, I'll, I'll get working on your project this week. Oh, uh, straight stitch. There we go. And back. Thank you. Thank you for saying hi and sharing the love to Miss Heldy. Appreciate it very much. You guys are an awesome community. Oops. What am I doing? Uh, whenever you feel the words or need to uh, hit the button. If you're in, uh, hopefully, there you go. Like, uh, you yeah. know, gotta do what you gotta do. Try also thread painting in it. And I turned mine into a wibbly wobbly pitch cushion. Hey, you're awesome. <laughs> hey, you did something with it, right? So that's all that matters. That's all that matters. Okay, let's do this. Yes, we love our Miss Ellie. Yes, we do. We miss her greatly. But we don't want to pressure her either. If she's not ready to come back, that's okay too. The love will always be here for her. A little f full around here is the fabric. sometimes <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm looking forward to making uh, Marcus's birthday cake though and his cookies cookies for the cake cake for the cookies whatever it'll be just like a small batch for just enough for the the cake so. as much as I like whipped shortbreads they don't seem to like me very much so treat next Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Oh, neat! But we will miss you. We will miss you on the Zoom. We had a nice virtual retreat. What are we, where are we going? What are we doing? Thank you, June. He had to meet a couple of weekends ago. During a stream here. There you go, Miss Bernadette. So it must be crazy over where you are there, Miss Bernadette, with all the partying and dancing. <laughs> Getting wild in the streets. Thank you, everybody, for sharing the love. Just a couple 
the little top stitches there. I know, that's what people say about making a mushroom hat. I should have. <laughs> or should. <laughs> I should, I should, I should. Mm -hmm. We can't wait to see the cheesecake. I, I will take a picture, I promise. Are you ready? I'm ready. Are you ready? <laughs> Sharon Patmore. Sharon Patmore, if you're in the chat, please say something because you won this hedgehog. Thank you. Bag <laughs> thing, my <Mom> bop. <laughs> oh, 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 gotta come back in closer here. Okay, that's all right. That's why we do these things. We check, we check. Sharon, where are you, Sharon? But you gotta say something. Why we 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 got we have to have have to have a response before we can move forward. Someone knows Sharon, get her on the phone. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> if you know Sharon, give her a She's call. Here. I'm in Tipperary with Oh nice! Fantastic! And congratulations, Sharon! Congratulations! Got yourself a little hedgehog project bag. We were in Dublin on the 17th, and there was a huge rainbow parade with restaurants we went to for dinner and had prime rib. Oh, that sounds delicious. Speak loudly, girl. <laughs> yeah, <right. laughs> no, she did say something. Thank goodness. Okay. I'm just poking out the corners, make sure it's all good. You know what you got to do, Sharon? Go fill out the things and do the things and click the things and then tell me the things. So we can get the things. Well, this thing to you. Yeah, you be sharing. You be sharing. You win yourself a hedgehog. You be sharing. Now I'll make a little tie with some embroidery floss for the little top of the zipper there. Oh, there. It's cute. Cute little hedgehog. Hi. Where's the other one? Oh, it's over there. Yeah, we saw her. We saw her. Yeah, she's gonna she's gonna email. Well she better. <laughs> Sorry? Oh fill out the form. Okay. And then this was the one we did yesterday, okay? We had some fun with that one. And that was just a different colored thread. Okay. And this one, like I said, well, actually, may, I, I kind of like the idea of being in a, a lap quilt because it's kind of, you know, fun to be a lap quilt. So I may just turn it into that. So just flip it out. Yeah. I'll do it some more stitches around in here for sure. Fill it in. Fill it in lots. There, that's the one we gave away today. And look what the cute little variegated thread does, right? And then we have this one too to play with, right? Let's see the color of that one. Yeah. And then this is what the other hedgehog was done in. And then this is what that hedgehog was done in. So it's just playing with some variegated thread. Thank you, Getsu Nancy. I appreciate that. Hey, Della. Thank you everybody for joining in on the giveaway. And uh, we don't usually like to put uh, giveaway in our titles because we don't want people to win that aren't going to be here that want to be here. So <laughs> it's not clickbait or anything. <laughs> we don't do that. Very cute. <laughs> Look good on my lap. <laughs> And just cute and easy. You know, you could have batting this too or stabilized it in some way. But see, look, the little hole on the inside. And you got a cute little pouch to hold all sorts of things. Could be cables, could be a little cutting mat, could be a cross stitch project, could be some blocks you're working on, some FPP, whatever. The little, little hedgehog because he's ready for action. Okay. What you gonna name her, Sharon? What, what you gonna name the hedgehog? Or are you gonna, you don't have to name it. <laughs> you don't have to name the hedgehog. Just cause I name everything, including, you know, cars and inanimate objects, but it's all right. You don't have to. <laughs> What's FPP? FPP is foundation paper piecing. Um, 
we did a dragon last weekend and if it wasn't base stitched already on the actually where's my phone because i took a picture of it i will show you what the we did two dragons one was a tester uh, we did him in green which is going to uh, as well to my son for his birthday um and do 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 here is the pink purple dragon we did so you can see how sharp those angles are that is done it's stitched on paper first uh, in reverse and then you flip it over okay and as you can tell i need to charge my phone <laughs> okay petals there we go that's kind of cute and there's the two of them on the long arm uh right there so the side by side do i get one of the green oh no 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 nope nope okay <laughs> name of petals <laughs> oh you're welcome there Sharon you're very welcome thank you for watching our little channel and thumbing up and subscribing and commenting and do all the things that got to be done so to, to get us out there we really appreciate uh, Claire loves a hedgehog too <laughs> they like the little one or the big one or does she like both of them <laughs> give her a big squishy hug please love you Claire <laughs> One day I'll get to see you. I mean, like in real life, not just pictures. Okay. Your fabulous company. <laughs> uh, anybody have any questions before we say goodbye? Okay. Let's turn the machine off. Got my tea. Cute little hedgehoggies. <laughs> I'm happy. I'm happy with that. Uh, I could make a bit. It would make a nice big pillow. I did think of that too, there, Maureen. I did think of, but it's almost it's big enough actually to be as a lap quilt. So, but not wall hanging. We'll figure it out. I haven't decided if I really want to micro stitch the background or just kind of leave it and just do what I'm doing there. It's still more thread painting fun to have on it. So, yeah. What would Claire call the hedgehog? There we go. That's a good idea. Bye bye for now. Take care, Karen Jones. See you later. You're well, any questions you have there, uh, Whiskey Sarcasm, I'm happy to help. And uh, if you want to know EPP, the person to talk to is definitely Craft a Simple Life. So cause she's, she's an EPP perpetual. <laughs> you guys have a great rest of the weekend, too. She says you are beautiful. I, she's beautiful, too. <laughs> and it's only because I look like you that I'm beautiful. So... I bought lap quilt. I kind of bought a lap quilt too for the car for travel. I think it'd be nice. Mm, great. They are great dragons. Uh, they turned out fantastic. And thank you to Miss Sylvia back. She's in the chat. Go uh, FP, you, me, FPP. Go set, show some love to her channel. She was the, all the brains behind the whole dragon um, pattern. And she's sharing it with you guys and how to put it together and everything else like that. I think she even did the second one as well. There was two dragons there. So have a great race to the week. Race. Uh-huh. Yeah, rest of the weekend too there, Joyce. Bye for now, Nina. <laughs> yeah, you have to you have a great weekend too, everybody. No, Miss Practically Creative. And Suzanne. And Linda Lindsay. Mm -mm -mm. Bye or sewing a leprechaun. <laughs> I try. I try. <laughs> Thank you, everybody. Okay, so if you uh, have any comments, I guess you can just leave it in uh, below. Uh other than that, we'll see you on Thursday. Remember, Tuesday I have my infusion, so we won't be here for Cross Stitch Tuesday. It'll be Cross Stitch Thursday. But if you are a member, you hit that little join button right about there and go for the 10 and up, and you get yourself into the Zoom as well as the project that we are winning on. You get a chance to win it. Okay? So there, there, 10. Okay? Or there, 10. Okay? 10. Okay? Okay. Love ya!